Theater Row. I absolutely love Theater Row. It comes in the bronze and it comes in the chrome. It's a great light the way that it's angled and I love the Edison bulbs. Look at those bulbs. Yeah. The bulbs are really a piece of art in themselves. Well, the Grayson collection is brand new and one of the things that we love to do is natural materials. So this is the Abaca uh, actual leaf which makes up this beautiful, very earthy shade. So we have a combination of contemporary of a nice earthy look with great grass type shades uh, and a very, very simple design. All right, what are we looking at here, James? We're looking at the Crystal Infusion. This is the Crystal Infusion family uh, from for Elk, Elk Lighting. I see a, uh, a small pendant, three light pendant, go perfect in a, uh, a small foyer or possibly a powder room, a temporary powder room. Definitely. The brand new piece from Nolco, it's called the Saturn. And on this piece, you have the, the crystals reflecting up the G9s in the middle. Very orbital feel. Uh, what is this series called? It's called the Solaris Collection. Solaris. So yes. it has something to do with the sun. Is it, that's correct. Is the whole thing. Yeah, it's the it. Very much like a piece of sculpture that we'd use in a house. We also make it as a chandelier. This is called the, the Harper Collection from, from Crystal Rama. What do we got going on here, Brad? We make it available in two finishes. One is called the Cognac, uh -huh. and then we also do it in ice blue. So it's actually a plated finish. So it gives you a little bit of metallic look. Uh -huh. It's great for contemporary interiors as well as traditional. We use both ways. It's a very youthful look the way we did it. The Cypress Collection of Crystal Rama is called wrought iron flowers, also detailed in a wet white. It's like a white metallic finish on top of iron and they're done in like these white roses. Uh -huh. Here you see the uh, Kobe Ladner and Kobe style collection. You're looking over here at the Teardrop collection which is a multi-tone finish fixture with amber crystal and clear crystal throughout. One of Kobe's um, particular aspects of her line is that she likes color. She likes to de decorate with a lot of color to bring life to the room. Uh, this right here is our Scandia series. It's a nice linen shade. On the bottom we have a plated uh, brush nickel finish. On the bottom we have a glass diffuser. This whole series comes in multiple configurations. They all come on hang straights so they could be uh, hung on slope ceilings. You have an oval over here, you have a pendant over here. Again, this is just one of many series from Steve and Chris. How many finishes you got? Uh, right now we're up to six different finishes. Uh, black chrome, raw copper, chromium, white, raw platinum, tangerine tango, 2012 Pantone color of the year. Nice! Ferrari red, the Rosa Corsa, and uh, the beautiful classic urban bronze. It's called the Vila. Vila, V-E-L-A? Correct. Tell me a little bit about it, because obviously it's groundbreaking technology. Well, a lot of people ask what comes after LED. Everybody's talking about LED so much that it's time to start to introduce the public to the next generation. Uh -huh. And organic LED takes the same concept as LED, but puts it in a nanometer scale. Nanometers. So, Those are small units of measure. Oh, 500 times thinner than the thickness of the human hair. That's the entire device that That is it. This is the uh, Palazzo collection. And the name Palazzo, Palazzo is Italian. Uh -huh. You know, meaning I think the big uh, plazas in the, the city. Sure. Like Florence and Rome. And yep. We go with an aquarium cornered glass. It's a miter corner with a clear cut on the edge so that you can see through the glass. And it, it has that aquarium effect. Uh huh. Okay. Great. You have uh, vanity pieces accent wall sconce pieces, and application pieces for every uh, every application in the home. You've got pendants, make a great addition over an island. Now this is the Underscore series. From Walt Disney Walt Signature Walt collection. Disney collection. I noticed that the, the edging here is a little different. How, how do they actually make this? It's a mitered corner. Uh -huh. It's called a mitered corner aquarium glass. Right. Very similar like to an aquarium, aquarium so you can look from corner to corner. Okay. New Bella Fiore collection by Metropolitan. Some great design techniques in here. What we've got is we've got a, uh, a hand pressed glass floret stacked on a center rod and it's illuminated with the GU uh, GU10. So it's got both up light, an up, up and a down light. 